Hello, everybody. Hope you're doing well. And this is the November edition of What's Up with Aishi. Like, really, what's up with me? Because, you know, I was supposed to do this、uh, program at the beginning of the month. And what's today? 30th of November. <laughs> Whenever I make this kind of video, I say, like, oh, maybe I should、uh, update regularly so that I get lots of YouTube followers and podcasts, you know. And I kind of promise, like, I'm gonna update regularly. I don't, you know, because I got good intention, everybody, but、um, I am a lazy bum, to be honest. <laughs> I am!、Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But anyway, I'm gonna tell you what's up with me. This month, I've been, I've been、uh, visiting schools, and、uh, that's becoming my main passion because I'm trained as a teacher.、Um, but you know, I, I don't practice teaching because、uh, I, I can't stay being a responsible adult、um, like all the time. Yes. I am a responsible adult, but、uh, you know, when I just、uh, go perform and teach where I could go, my commitment is just for one hour. So I can stay being a、uh, uh, responsible adult and then go like、uh, after workshop, we go, <laughs> now I can get back to、um, lazy bum self.、Um, but anyway, a funny thing happened. <laughs> I、uh, visited this、uh, school. I'm not going to tell you where, but、uh, um, so I was ready, you know, set up the、uh, zabuton, the cushion, and、uh, I was introduced. And uh, today, uh, Hiroshi is here. Hiroshi is my real name. And Hiroshi will be sharing martial arts. <laughs> and,、uh, I was like, what? I, I, I'm not here for martial arts, but I, I was introduced as a martial artist. And、um, I was like, what? Anyway, I said, like, sorry, I'm not、um, here for martial arts, but、uh, I was really tempted. I am actually trained as a martial artist, and I started martial arts when I was six, and I'm still kind of doing it, regardless of my back problem.、Um, so it's been like, what, 30 years? 80 years or something, and I, I was tempted. I, I am an improviser as well. <laughs> so, shall I make up the whole session? <laughs> should I go like, hey kids, and then do like martial arts moves? And、uh, I could have made up, but、uh, I didn't. But that was fantastic. So, obviously, I was booked、uh, by an accident, but. Awesome thing is that,、uh, thanks to that, I got to、uh, meet those、um, students and、uh, they enjoyed it. We had a fantastic time. And、uh, more people now、uh, performed for about、um, maybe 100 students total. And、uh, um, so now they know. What Rakugo is. So that is a、uh, you know, blessing in disguise. So thank you so much. And I'm not making fun of you, <laughs> but、uh, that was a surprise, but great gift. So thank you so much. And、uh, oh, another news,、uh, big news is that I've been working、um, on the film project with a、uh, fantastic, really lovely、uh, film director called Fiona Amundsen. And I'm gonna probably、uh, put the link to her website below, not on the screen because I don't know how to do it, but、uh, in the details section below this video will be there. So、um, she is a film director, kind of documentary director, or like an arty sort of you know, visual artist, like digital visual artist kind of person, and very well established. Uh, very talented, very intellectual person. And、uh, she came up with this concept to、um, combine the reminder of the tragedy of World War II, especially the uh, uh, Hiroshima and Nagasaki you know, atomic bombing. And she wanted to combine、um, the message of you know, peace and the reminder of all the mistakes we made. And、uh, also combining that with the Aikido. The martial arts,、um, that's a way of, you know, non violence kind of martial arts. And、uh, also,、um, Rakugo, the、uh, 
traditional storytelling from Japan. So I'm gonna um, write, well, I have already finished writing the script, but it's basically my conversation with my grandpa. My grandpa um, experienced Nagasaki, so, uh, and I lost my great-grandfather in Nagasaki and uh, his daughters there. And my grandpa's youngest brother, um, is a Hibakusha. He's still alive, I think, and he um, he was at the near the epicenter of Nagasaki, but he somehow survived and is still alive. But that's amazing. <laughs> so I got a really strong gene. But um, anyway, so that's the project I'm working on, and I'll be uh, performing Rakugo. Um, I mean, my conversation with the grandpa in the Rakugo format, and uh, there is humor in it, but it's heavy subject. So um, I am trying to figure out how to present that, pretend that, pre I can't say, pre pretend, no, present, uh, present, birthday present, Christmas present, I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how to present um, a difficult subject in a sort of lighthearted way, but uh, with a sort of meaningful depth to it. So that's what I'm doing, and uh, this project is gonna probably last till January or something like that. So I'll be busy doing that, and uh, yeah. So basically, that's it. And I really hope everybody um, who's watching this as well. And uh, it's a bit difficult time, yeah, for everybody. But I uh, uh, hope I can um, cheer you up somehow through Rakugo, and that's why I do this thing. So uh, yeah. Stay well, and uh, um, hope to see you next time at, uh, uh, in the uh, December edition of What's Up With Aishi. Uh, tomorrow's December, but I'm not gonna obviously pass you know, another one tomorrow, but uh, um, yes, so this is what's happening. And if you haven't followed my channel, uh, please do follow it. And uh, um, if more people follow, then it's likely that I, I'm gonna post more. <laughs> And I actually um, commit to commit to what I say. Like, you know, I'm gonna actually actually update. Don't trust this guy. Don't trust this guy. Uh, but who knows? Yeah, uh, you're not gonna know until you do. So anyway, um, stay well and uh, stay positive, and hope to see you next time. All right, have a nice day.